The county is bracing for a possible influx of migrants that could come across our southern international border next week. This is because a Trump era policy known as Title 42 is set to be lifted. News for Tucson's Gabrielle Parrish is live now at one of several Pima County shelters that welcome migrants. And Gabrielle, what does the county have in place to help people coming across the border? Monica, just 10 minutes ago, migrants got off a bus at the Casa Alita shelter that I'm at right now. We cannot show the shelter or people due to safety purposes. Now, Pima County is bracing for a surge of immigrant arrivals. They've had a plan in place for a while now that supports more than 500 people per day, but they are concerned that they may not have enough space depending on how many people arrive. The Biden administration is planning to lift Title 42 next week. That's the public health order that was put in place by the Trump administration. It's a public health order that allows the U.S. to expel migrants from the border during the COVID pandemic. Right now, the attorney generals of several states are fighting to keep the order in place. Here in Pima County, officials tell us that those coming across the border are already in custody of Homeland Security. And if there's a surge of migrants next week, the county has emergency contracts through the city of Tucson to take in a few hundred people. But there are still concerns. But there's the possibility that um, we will the amount of people released will exceed capacity and we're uncertain at the moment what that will mean for the community. The county is planning to convert a 60,000 square foot office space into a shelter, but that won't be ready for the next couple of weeks. Reporting live from the South Side, Gabrielle Parrish, News 4 Tucson.